location that showed you the damage at the Market Street trestle. Since our story aired last week, the township says conditions around the tracks have worsened. Our Mike Trim covering the story for us tonight. He's live in our Wilkes-Barre newsroom with this follow-up report. Mike. Andrew, Market Street is just a small roadway underneath this trestle, but it's closed until further notice. And that's causing big problems for that neighborhood. Market Street is closed underneath this old rusted railroad trestle in Pittston Township. Teresa Prepish's home sits next to what township leaders call an accident waiting to happen. Well, there's lots of trouble there, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, everything when it comes down at times. The township closed Market Street early Tuesday morning. And zoning officer Terry Best said if it wasn't shut down, falling debris could have caused costly car damage. We're concerned for the citizens up in the area is what it comes down to. And, you know, I don't think that they have to be worried about, you know, driving under this underpass or overpass and, and uh, ending up with a problem with a, a rock on the windshield. Best and Township Supervisor Stephen Rinaldi say the trestle needs to be rebuilt and widened to allow emergency vehicles through. Reading and Northern Railroad owns the trestle. Best says the township solicitor is in contact with the company. A Reading and Northern inspector was on scene Tuesday morning, but that inspector didn't say if repairs are scheduled. Since we showed you the damage Friday, this hole has opened up in between the tracks. It's causing rocks to fall through the hole onto the road underneath. Tony DeSanto lives next to the tracks. Yes, it is frustrating. Uh, there's only one entrance and exit now to the whole area, and uh, that's no good. If a train uh, gets stopped, stopped or stuck on the tracks on the other side, there's no way to get in or out for an ambulance or fire or anything like that. Now DeSanto has to take a detour blocks away, an unwelcome headache caused by this troubled trestle. Reading and Northern Railroad has not returned our calls for comment today or Friday when we originally brought you this story. The township solicitor for Piston Township has been in contact with the Public Utility Commission as well to try to find a solution for that trestle. We are live in the Wilkes-Barre Newsroom tonight.